Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Good afternoon, friends. Today is Friday as usual. I am doing right now treble cam, Canon R with Canon 85 millimeter and Canon ATD with Sigma 35 millimeter plus Sony A72 with Sony 35 millimeter. Photographer Joe Studio Manhattan, New York City. Welcome to my studio. Make sure you have good of how to make your ascension and it's something that in experienced photographers often overlook the first step is making sure you have enough light that your subject is visible if there is not enough light your camera may struggle to capture the details in the scenes if you happen to be shooting with your camera on automatic setting which is not how to take professional photos but more on that layer it will use a high ISO setting or extra long exposure and you will build you will be probably end up with grainy or blurry results and if you try to brighten things up in Photoshop, you may find you have to make massive adjustments which also results in a low quality images. Photographer Joe Studio Manhattan, New York City. Welcome to my studio. Thank you very much. Have a good night and have a nice weekend. Bye. Take of your attention where you want it to go. That can include drawing their eyes straight to your subject or leading them on a kind of virtual journey through your composition.
Number two, get more lighting equipment. Relying slowly on a available light is not always the right how or way to take professional pictures. If you do, then you are severely limited yourself. Professional photographers spend a lot of time planning out lighting and they use a range of lighting equipment. But you don't need to spend a lot of money to take the lighting in your photography to the next level. Try out a light reflector. One affordable piece of equipment that will help you manage your lighting is a light reflector. You could pick up a five-in-one light reflector for around $20, and it will give you a lot of options of main plotting light in your shots. This very steel light if reflectors come with reversible covers made from different type of reflective materials. For instance, they have silver covers that reflect lots of bright light, white covers that reflect softer light and black covers for helping you remove light from scenes. By providing a simple way to start mint polluting light is your shots. Light reflectors are a big help when it comes to, ra to rabbing your head around how to take professional photos. Number three, take advantage of camera flashes and diffusers. Main jumping in white powder flash photography. If you understand that lighting is an important part of how to make photographs look professional, you may be thinking about investing in lighting equipment, such as studio strobe, but don't overlook your camera flash. If you stay uh, away from using it because you find the light is too harsh, there are a number of solutions. One of the best options would be to invest in an external flash, external flash camera flashes, which use attached to your camera's hotshot or use of camera can give you much more flexibility. For one, they enable you to aim the light rather than have it blasting directly to your subject. Thank you very much, my friends. I think I did a good job today for the people. They need to learn more about photography. Just keep it in your mind and try to do it for good results. Thank you very much. Have a good night and have a nice weekend. Bye.
ده الحاجه لازم تبقى فيه حاجتين 